esterni al sistema solare. Volevo sapere... At the beginning of February, these astronomers announced the coming exhibit on the Vatican's observatory. In a way, it will tell the story of the universe. This exhibition tries to tell the history of the universe that is outside of us, the galaxies and stars, and the universe that is within us, that is, the atoms of our bodies that have been formed within the stars. So, it's to tell the story of the universe within and outside of us. At the same time, it relates the history of the Vatican Specola, its observatory. There are going to be some valuable books from our library on exposition, as well as a collection of the most important meteorites we have, among which is a rock from the moon and another from Mars. The exhibition will be held at the Blue Palace in Pisa, the hometown of Galileo and Cardinal Pietro Maffi, who in 1904 took over the Vatican's observatory. Today, the observatory is located in the Pope's residence at Castle Gandolfo, but it now uses a telescope based in Tucson, Arizona, for its studies. And why are Catholics so interested in astronomy? The Catholic should see a gift of God in the cosmos. As for any other creature, the Catholic, the believer, the person of goodwill, and maybe even the non-believer, it is possible to admire the beauty of the universe, of the cosmos. That beauty that we see carries us in some way to the beauty of the Creator. And also because God has given us intelligence, reason, we can find the Logos, that rational explanation that there is something in the universe that allows us to make science as well. It speaks to us of the creative logic of God. According to the head of the specula today, the astronomer Cardinal Maffi continues to teach that there is no conflict between science and faith. In these times when frequently, and often without any foundation, science and faith are presented as enemies in an ancestral holy war, the figure of Cardinal Maffi, in a period that wasn't easy for the relationship between science and faith, is a figure that can still speak to us today. In him are found those aspects of the human experience which can work together in the search for the deepest significance of human existence. Thank you.